Hi guys, and I'm sorry I'm in the same outfit and hair and everything as the last video, but I got a few things in the mail today and I thought I would go ahead and open them on camera. I have not peeked, I just cut the bag open and this is a very pretty um, lilac color bag too, very pretty. And this is from Zany Laney. It is um, her box of the month. And I'm going to just take everything out and just sit it out here. Oh my goodness, I didn't realize there was this much. Ooh, it smells good in here. And here is the card, Alexandria, Virginia. Now, I have not been keeping up with wa The Walking Dead. Um, I want to start it over and watch it from the beginning. But this is where it originates, I believe, or... Is it where they are at now? I, I don't know. But um, it says, While this month's The Walking Dead theme is not exactly about the holidays, we have to celebrate not only one of our favorite shows, but also the fact that they come together as a family to protect each other. It, if that's not something to be thankful for, I don't know what is. All right. So let's start with born leader it's uh, strawberry pineapple eucalyptus and lemongrass and this is I really like that all right so it's Maggie I'm sorry Maggie has come so far from being the farmer's daughter in season two. Will she finally realize her purpose as someone we can all get behind? Strawberries and pineapple for the sweetness. Eucalyptus and lemongrass for the grit. All right, let's go on to Lucille. And I know who Lucille is. <laughs> My favorite actor. Jeffrey is, oh my God, does he make a good, um, what's his name? See, I'm not up on The Walking Dead. I'm so sorry. Um, the most terrifying short-range weapon belonging to Negan, who we love to hate or hate to love. Either way, we imagined he would smell like leather, fire, and rain, perfect for the long winter's night. Anyway, Jeffrey is one of my favorite actors. I absolutely love him. In P.S. I love you. Oh my gosh. Oh. Let's smell him. Oh wow. That is definitely a manly scent. All right. Okay, those two. Let's go with Southern Angel. Coffee, mold cider, oak, and cloves. I think I'm wondering if that's what I smelled right away. If Daryl dies, we riot. And this scent is complex, dark, and comforting as he as he is. Coffee, mold cider, oak, and clove. Oh, wow. Hmm. I can definitely smell the coffee. Definitely smell the coffee. All right, let's go with Carol's cookies. Chocolate chip cookies, Macintosh apples. And look at the gun and the knife. <laughs> Do a very good job on the artwork. All right. While poking around online, we found the actual rep recipe Carol uses to make cookies in Alexandria. Her secret ingredient is applesauce. Ours is the scent of Mac Macintosh apple 
that we mixed in with the cookie dough. I think that I have a feeling this is going to be my favorite. Oh yeah, I can definitely smell that apple. Hmm. Yum. All right, and pudding, anyone? This is gourmet dark chocolate, yum, and banana pudding. Okay, before Rick and Carl go to Alexandria, Carl finds a lot of pudding and passes the time by sitting on the roof eating it in his sheriff's hat, watching the walkers go by. Dark chocolate mixed with banana pudding. This is going to be... Oh my God. I know which one's my favorite. <laughs> And it is the pudding. I love this. So anyway, there was five. Five cents this month. And I I can't wait. To, I bought a burner. So I'm going to start burning tonight. Thank you so much for this box. I did receive this free for um, review purposes. And... I can't wait to start using it and I will see you all later and um, I will tag Lainey below and share it on my Instagram and so on and my Twitter. So thank you so much and I'll talk to you very soon. Bye bye.